Amid the ongoing conflict in Ukraine and growing international support for Kyiv, Germany has announced a significant military initiative aimed at bolstering NATO's air defense capabilities. On November 28, 2024, Berlin proposed deploying Patriot air defense systems to Poland, a strategic move to protect a critical logistics hub used for transporting military supplies to Ukraine. This proposal, which has been submitted to NATO for approval, highlights Germany's continuing commitment to securing vital supply chains that are crucial to Ukraine's war effort against Russia. The German Ministry of Defense outlined that the deployment of the Patriot systems would be a temporary measure, lasting up to six months, and would focus on safeguarding key infrastructure vital to the flow of weapons, ammunition, and vehicles necessary for Ukraine's defense. The initiative comes at a time when the war in Ukraine has escalated, with Russian forces continuing their offensive launched in February 2022. German Defense Minister Boris Pistorius underscored the importance of the logistics hub in Poland, describing it as a vital link in the supply chain that sustains Ukraine's military efforts. The decision to deploy these advanced systems to Poland follows a similar move earlier this year, when Patriot systems were stationed in southeastern Poland near the Ukrainian border, offering protection to a crucial railway hub. This decision also aligns with Germany's broader military support for Ukraine, a role the country has played since the start of the invasion, becoming the European Union's largest supplier of military aid to Kyiv. The Patriot MIM-104 missile defense system, originally developed by the United States and deployed since the 1980s, has become a cornerstone of NATO's integrated air defense network. The system is designed to counter a wide range of airborne threats, including tactical ballistic missiles, cruise missiles, and aircraft. It features advanced radar technology, including the passive electronically scanned array radar, which allows for simultaneous detection, tracking and engagement of multiple targets while maintaining resilience against electronic countermeasures. The Patriot system is equipped with several missile variants, such as the PAC-2 and PAC-3, each designed to counter different types of airborne threats. The PAC-3 missile, for instance, employs hit-to-kill technology to intercept warheads with exceptional precision. A typical Patriot battery consists of launchers capable of carrying multiple missiles, multifunction radar units, control stations, and communication systems. This comprehensive set of capabilities makes the Patriot system an ideal choice for defending against sophisticated aerial threats. The deployment of the Patriot systems to Poland would significantly enhance Poland's air defense and strengthen NATO's position on the alliance's eastern flank. Poland has become a key logistics hub for military supplies to Ukraine, making it an increasingly important strategic target for Russia. By stationing Patriot batteries in Poland, NATO would improve its ability to deter and defend against potential missile and aerial threats from Russia, ensuring the security of both Poland and neighboring member states. The presence of Patriot systems in Poland would also serve as a clear demonstration of NATO's commitment to collective defense, particularly in the context of the ongoing war in Ukraine. For Germany, the proposal represents a further step in its growing involvement in regional defense, even as the country faces challenges within its own military. The Bundeswehr, Germany's armed forces, continues to grapple with issues of underfunding and outdated equipment. However, the German government, under Chancellor Olaf Scholz, has undertaken a significant rearmament program, seeking to address these shortcomings and strengthen the country's defense capabilities. Germany's proposal to deploy Patriot systems to Poland comes as the country continues to work on addressing the defense challenges it faces. The delivery of Patriot systems to Ukraine since 2022 has depleted some of Germany's stock, prompting the German government to sign a 1.4 billion euro contract in March 2024 to procure additional Patriot batteries. With nine operational units currently in service, these new acquisitions will help replenish Germany's missile defense capabilities and ensure that the Bundeswehr remains a key player in European defense. However, while Germany has made significant contributions to Ukraine's defense, including the delivery of advanced air defense systems like the Patriot, the country has refrained from providing long-range missiles, unlike the United States or the United Kingdom. This has sparked debate within NATO, as some members call for further support to bolster Ukraine's ability to strike deep behind enemy lines. Germany's proposal to deploy Patriot air defense systems to Poland is a timely and strategically sound decision that enhances NATO's defensive capabilities in Eastern Europe. By protecting critical logistical infrastructure used to support Ukraine, Germany and its NATO allies are strengthening their collective security in the face of an ongoing Russian threat. The temporary deployment, though limited in scope, underscores the alliance's commitment to defending its member states and safeguarding key supply chains that are vital to the success of Ukraine's war effort. As NATO continues to adapt to the evolving nature of modern warfare, 
the integration of advanced defense technologies like the Patriot system will play a crucial role in ensuring the security of its eastern border.